All right, hello everybody. My name is Ecstatic here, and welcome. Sorry. <laughs> um. Anyway, the uh, welcome to Back to Dreams, and uh, today we're gonna play a game, The Adventures of a Toy, a tribute. This game is based off of a uh, Toy Story, one of my uh, favorite movies growing up. Um, I'd say it's like my third, second favorite movie growing up. My first one was The Incredibles, but unfortunately nobody's really made something like that. Like, a uh, as amazing as this room appears to be, what is this? This seems to be a remix of a previous room that might have been made before this one. Uh, description reads, help Woody and Buzz on an unforgettable adventure. Each level is an authentic movie location and has different play styles. Kind of sounds like we've got a. It, it kind of is like a, the Toy Story 3 game. Or like a, the games that came out with the movies, like movie licensed video games. Uh, or officially licensed, however you want to say it. But, uh. Yes, yeah, it's made with, uh, by A Life is Neil as Neil. Sorry if I'm not saying your name correctly. And many others. Uh, props to our creators. This already looks great. So let's get in and find out. I kind of went to the start menu, but... Yeah, I haven't seen anything after this. Let's start. That music alone gives me... Fl uh, it just brings me a lot of nostalgia. I remember this Toy Story 1 Alright Let's see how this is going to work This already looks Like I said Looks great so far I don't think, uh, I don't think it, it will decline in quality. Alright, well, we're playing as Woody. Fantastic model. In fact, I think this is like 100% spot on. I don't know who said that, but thank you. So... Apparently this game's got, like, multiple levels, which is pretty cool. I don't know what mo uh, this is from. This is from Toy Story 1. And all the Toy Story movies, basically. Oh, it's Slinky. Why can I just imagine their voices saying those lines? Like, whenever I'm playing a game, based off of a video game, or based off of a movie, I imagine their voices just reprising the roles, or, or saying the stuff that they say in the game. Like, is that just me, or... Nah, no, I'm pretty sure that's not just me. Let's get a little look to you around here. I just that we all remember that from Toy Story 2. I usually I used to have one of these or like a couple of them. Um Here's Mr. Rex. What have you got for us? Okay, this is uh That's a pretty good recreation of that scene. Not coming off as annoying, bud. 
You're a dinosaur, you're doing your job, which is to scare people. Oh, hey, here's one of the little army sergeants. I remember those guys. Then here's uh, from the famous scene to infinity and beyond. <laughs> I remember that line. It's one of the most famous ones, and uh, I have to say it's a very memorable one. Ah, the Lux. Uh, this reminds me of the lamp guy from. Uh, Oh, I'm sorry. Um, that reminds me of the... Oh, this fork. <laughs> Little do we know. <sighs> yep. Uh, but what like I was saying, that reminds me of the lamp that always shows up. What's his name? Luxo? There's Sid's house. Uh, Luxo the lamp, I believe, that always appears in the beginning of every film ever. Sorry for stomping on your head. I remember those drawings. Those are also from that movie. Th this whole room is just incredible. This is some great detail. Sorry, sheep. This... This is a lot of great details. I remember all of this. Mr. Potato Head! You poor soul. Can I, uh... I was about to ask if I could help find them, but... Oh, nice! Achievement! So... Find mi one Mr. Fidel had an art location to unlock a special guest character. Alright. Whoops. I duck. No, I can't duck. Oh well. Then there's the set from the beginning of Toy Story. That is another. They have a lot of Easter eggs in this game. Like, this is very well detailed. Props are creators. Like, I can't say this enough. This is just incredible. Sure, the music may be original, and that's nice. But this all gives me a lot of flashbacks, like that poster over there. Can I talk to this guy? Nope. I wish I could talk to... Hmm? Sheriff mode? That's nice. I didn't even think to use that. Whoopsie. This must be... <laughs> this must be... Or at least these stages must be... I don't know how much of this is gonna be based off of Toy Story 1, but we'll see. I got under here. Oh wait a minute, I gotta jump on the side something. There we go, but how do I... Oh. There's gotta be somewhere I could get out at. I don't want to restart this. Wait. Never mind. I don't have to.
How do I get out though? Come on. It appears I am stuck. Oh, never mind. That's a pretty cool feature. You can see all the badges you have to collect. All you need to do now is get up there. Ooh, I found them. Or at least I found a part of them. I think you have to return to the stage after you collect all six. just jump up here. There we go. You even got the little car from the scene. That's incredible. That's that's very nice. Very nice touch. They got all the small and the major details that make Toy Story. Or at least that are consistent in the Toy Story movies. I like this. This is a great room. Great room. Who can I enter? Oh. Basically kind of the same, if not different. I don't know. It's kind of the, the same. Blech. It's kind of the same uh, themes from the films. We created in dreams, so that's very nice. That just goes to show that you could, uh... You always follow your dreams. And, uh... I'm not so much of a creator myself, but... If anyone wants to create a room, then go ahead and try, because, uh... Get in there. Hmm. Oh, I gotta do something. I probably gotta go collect that last star over there. Possibly. Okay, so that wasn't the last star. Of course I discover that star right there as soon as I get off of the crib. Oh well. Now my question is, how do we get in? Oh, never mind. My question is answered. Now let's see what the present is, even though I have a feeling that's gonna be. That's actually another good Easter egg.
We all know what truly happened there. Help Woody and Buzz sneak into the pizza plant truck without being caught. This is truly incredible. Like, I have to give props to the creators. This is... Holy... The music is great. The models... These people took their time and it shows. They did their homework and... I have to say, this is incredible. Now let's move on. To chapter 2. I think after this stage, I'm gonna call it wraps and... Pause menu. Hi, I here. Kind of no sense that he's looking around and stuff, but this is some very nice jazz music. Keep going to your Another Easter.
Where even am I? I don't know how I died there. This is some really nice music. Oh. keep getting cut. Where am I going? I have to go under the car. Oh, wait a minute. Oh! Ha! Fooey! Sorry, that was my bad. I guess you don't have to go under the car, but you have to go uh, down? I guess? Maybe? I mean, it would only make sense. I was going the wrong way this to the vehicle. Great, now we gotta worry about that. Let's go this way. This is a lot of nostalgia right here. Yes, it is. I forgot. Let me just pause here and say for a second how incredible this is. Like, holy. Like, oh my god. Okay, let me save this for the end. This is incredible, man. As soon as this loads up, I'm gonna finish up. Holy! Hello. Hello. Pause menu. 
All right, well, I think I'm going to end it here for now. Oh my. Oh, this is such a good game. And again, credit to Mr. Life as Neil. Is from, I think that's the creator of this entire thing. I'm not sure, but oh, yeah, he is. This is, oh, I have to give credits to you, my guy, and everyone who worked on this. All of the dreamers that worked on this. This is so amazing. Like, I, <laughs> I knew that this could be possible, but it, it takes a lot of dedication to make something as great as this, especially to something that we all hold near and dear to our hearts, because we all love, you know, movies like this, because we grew up with these movies. I didn't technically grow up with these movies, I, I kind of did, but they didn't release by the time I, uh, by the time I was born, this was like already an old movie, kind of, but again, this is incredible, and I highly, strongly recommend you guys check this out, because there's a lot more that apparently it seems to be, you know, in this, so, uh, yeah, I'll probably do end up doing some more episodes eventually, but for now, make, uh, make sure I leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you have not, uh, Turn on post notifications of the one I upload next. And, uh, yeah, go check out this from and support these creators. They're amazing. And the last one from the last video. So, uh, yeah. Exact signing out, everybody.